Hey, how you doing, Ryobi Fanatics? Um, man, I'm excited to do this review. So this is the new 6-gallon shop vacuum that just came out. Um, I have the old style. <clears throat> There's actually two different versions, a V1 and a V2. Um, they had a, a kind of a thumb switch on the handle, if you guys have seen those. Um, one was a toggle, one was a slide switch. And this new model, um, you probably can't see it in the shot, so I'll tilt it for you in just a second, but it's got quite a few new features on it that I wanted to kind of touch on today. Um, I haven't even really had a chance to use it too much. Um, I kind of put everything back in the configuration it was when I took it out of the box. So um, just to kind of give you a quick overview, um, the top of it looks like this now with a collapsible handle. Um, you can also see the switch there. It's got a two position switch. It's got a low and a high setting, which is pretty cool. Um, you might ask yourself why you need that. Well, you know, a array of different reasons. Um, there's also a blower function on this. So that high low switch gives you two speeds on the blower as well. So we'll go over that in just a minute, but to start off, um, you might notice this difference. These extension tubes pop in and out of plastic caddies that are built onto the side now, that you can see, rather than those bungees that it used to have. So that's an awesome feature. Um, these clasps on the side, a lot more robust. You've got metal to this now, not just the plastic. So those are awesome. Um, the accessory storage on the back looks similar to how it used to. It's got the accessories in the bungee cords here. Um, it comes with both the chisel tip and kind of this wide angle of room tip. And then it comes with these two extensions like the old model did. So you also have your onboard caddy for the hose up top here. Um, I've, I've got this six amp battery ready to go. That pops right in and sits in there and you still have some height left if you wanted to put in the eight hour or eight amp hour, the 12 amp hour. Um, it'd probably just flush out with the top there. So let's take a look at this. So the hose, that it comes with, very similar to the old one here. Uh, you got the corrugated plastic hose. Uh, main difference, obviously, is like we said, there's a blower port now. So make sure you get it on the right side for suction. This side on this side is the suction side. Did you hear that snap on? I don't know if you have the old style or heard the old style. It doesn't do that. It, you kind of have to work it a little bit. So that's also nice. Um, you get that positive click. So let's turn this on on the low setting. See what that sounds like first. Not bad. Now we'll put it on the high setting. Yeah, definitely has 30% more suction. This thing is awesome. So I can't wait to use this. Um, I use this all the time in my garage, or the old one rather. So um, this is gonna be exciting. because so I'm just, like I said in a couple videos ago, I'm getting ready to do some projects here in the garage. So this is gonna come in handy. Um, again, kind of the quick features that changed on this. Collapsible handle, one speed, two speed. You have a blower port here on the back, so you just take this hose off, stick it on here, and it becomes a blower. Um, and then your battery compartment is recessed down in. It's no longer on the back side of the handle, so that makes it nice. And then this is recessed quite a bit here. I don't know if you can see this, but let me turn it sideways here. So where that hose goes in on the top before it was relatively flat, um, now it's got a nice little pocket for that hose to coil up in, so that helps too to keep everything organized. And then you've got these positive attachment plastic clips instead of the bungees. So I like that a lot. That's a great feature. Um, the clips here are a lot more robust and then the 30% more suction. So again, check this out. It's the PCL 735B, six gallon wet dry shop vacuum from Ryobi. Um, I believe it retails here for 149. It says coming soon on the website, but I found it in my local Home Depot. So pick one up if you guys need one. Um, it's pretty awesome. So thanks for watching guys, appreciate it.